In 1993, while under house arrest, infamous drug kingpin Pablo Escobar produced his own sitcom. All record of the production was locked in a vault by the DEA. Until now. Pablo was filmed in front of a live terrified studio audience. <laughs> ah, just in time for the game. No remote. Jeez, Dad, you don't look too happy. No, I am not happy. I wanted to watch the game, but somebody put the remote in a more remote location. <laughs> but Dad, you're the only one that ever uses a remote. Last time I tried to use it, you threatened to cut my hands off. Oh, geez, oh, it's true, Pablo. Maybe you should retrace your steps. You woke up and... And I killed 15 police officers and had breakfast with a friend. And then what? And then I took the helicopter to the cleaners and I bought 7,000 flamingos. Ooh, more flamingos? They were on sale. I buy in bulk. <laughs> what would you do after that, Dad? After that, I threatened to kill the Pope. And I killed the Pope. And I installed a new Pope. My friend Gary. Gary's gonna owe me one. Uh, and then I wanted to watch a game, but I can't watch a game because there's no remote control. <sighs> That's it. I'm gonna shoot you, you stupid television. And stand on this once and for all. Uh oh. Pop Gary has my gun. Growing up Cuban, I learned that years of economic isolation turned every Cuban into MacGyver. My name is Chris Garcia, and here's some life hacks I learned from my Cuban family. If you lose a Tupperware lid like you left it in Pitbull's helicopter or Gloria Stefan's sound machine, here's a trick I learned from my abuela. 